a wind blower or something. Ow. That's better. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Yeah, there were two gentlemen that, um, I just got a no. <laughs> Wait, yes, sir. Oh, in that lie? Well, no, I'm saying, like, like I'm kind of like, where are you going with this? Like, that's where I'm trying to figure out, like, did you talk they to them? They to say they were being stalked and bullied by Rose. Oh, yeah, that's, see, that's not what's going on, but I get what. I get how it was perpetuated. I was there to witness the whole situation. Well, if it, the, so if they're saying that that's what's happening and you say it's not, then what is happening? So what happened was with that situation, it was, it, it got all messed up. So what happened was I went into that live. I knew one of the people that was, I knew the one of the gentlemen that was in that live. So I knew him from a mutual of mine. So I went inside of that live and then Rose followed me into there. She wasn't reading the room because that was like a live about like both of the guys in there were gay. So I was in there and he was talking about a, he was talking about, okay, like some guy he was flirting with online, whatever. So we're in there and Rose was not reading the room and she comes in and he say, I think he said something like, oh, I'm from Ohio, something like that. She jumped on that and then started a political discussion. And it wasn't a political live. Like, we're not debating anything. We're not talking about that. Then she had to open her mouth later on and say, hey, you know, I go or something about like, um, what is it like? Basically, like, um. She she's like, well, don't believe everything about me, or, but if you need to go to these extremes. So he went in and he looked at the videos and, you know, there's a lot of videos about her and, you know, the whole thing. So then it perpetuated from there. And then what happened was I was sit, standing up for her. So then it, it just turned into a big ball of fire, which I... I got defensive too because both of them, I've seen them on lives before and they've been intoxicated. Like the other night I was in one of those, one of those guys lives and he was in so intoxicated that we were talking about gun rights or pew pew rights. And, um, he blocked two people because he didn't even know what he was doing. So, and this dude has been following me around because he likes me. He has like an attraction to me. So that's why I went into that live. And then what they did was they spin the narrative around last night and then perpetuated it on I'm this, I'm that. And it, it was just a nightmare. It was a nightmare. And like, then they were trying to question like my credentials, her credentials. And then he was sitting there like, what was it like basically like um i said he was spewing credentials and i'm like i was like okay well let me I, i'm like you can't just say credentials and then not show like what you're talking about like like even last night after i talked to rose i said rose i don't even know if you have a, a master's degree in political science and i said here show me it and she did she proved to me he has never sent me any of his credentials and said, what, here, um, what credentials are you looking for, honey? Well, no, we were talking because we were talking about political science. Like, so he's saying I have like a minor or I have this and that. Like, and I told him, I said, well, I have an undergraduate degree in behavioral sciences. So like, that's what I'm saying. Like, he wasn't providing the proof to say, hey, like here, show me the credentials. Like he was sitting there spewing all this. And then for some reason, he's like, I don't know where he got that out of anywhere. But then he's like. He's like, oh, I don't feel, um, I don't know, like how he perpetuated. He was like, I don't know. I just, I feel weird about talking to me and you, blah, blah, blah. Then we got dropped. Then I tried to explain it to him. It just turned into a yelling match and it just did not end well. So then I just was like, okay, 
I'm like, and then it was getting like personal attacks instead of like debating. It was starting to come from a personal level. And then I felt uncomfortable and I was like, okay, I need to drop. And me and him kind of ended it. And then he perpetuated it even further saying that the only reason why he apologized to me was because he didn't want me like harassing him, which is like all in his mind or whatever the situation is. So it was just, it was a whole weird situation. (laughs) Hmm. So it was just, it was a, (laughs) it was not a good situation overall. I just had like, um, I just like, he blocked me, whatever the situation, I don't know. I just, it was crazy. But he said that he went into other lives and, um, you guys kept following her or she kept following him. Or, yeah, he said she. I never followed him because he blocked me, so I don't know what he's talking about. Like, and half the time he's intoxicated, so I can't even say like I can't even take what he says as serious because the other well, he night he sound intoxicated this morning. He wasn't. I'm just saying that. Well, this morning, yeah, this morning. But he's t- every time I'm on a live with him, he's intoxicated. And now I know his whole background story, which I think there's a lot of mental illness there because I heard him talking in another live so i got the backstory kind of about him and what was going on so i think that there's mental illness which one was that that's um trump not the real the real the real deal the real deal yeah yeah the real deal no wait wait who are you talking about i'm confused because that's not the name of the person. Um, yeah, this guy, um, his name was The Real D Y L E. I think he's. Oh, no, that's not the person. That's not even remotely who the person is. This person, oh, did, no. this person did change their name, though, and privatize their account because they're younger. See, okay, I. Okay, I think you're talking about the second guy that came in, or the third yeah. guy. Yeah, this Trent, one was the Trent first is who he was talking about originally. Trent yes. is the one that came in first. Yes. yes, Trent was the one that originally came in, and then I came in on that live. And then this is, that's how it got perpetuated, because I was in there for a long time. And then when Rose came in, it started turning into like a, no, it, Nemo, it's not Dylan's live. Dylan knows Trent, though, so I'm probably going to have to, I don't know if that... I don't know if I'm going to have to block Dylan. I don't want to, but I mean, it's just, it's to me, honestly, it was just not appropriate how the situation was handled. And to be honest, I felt a lot of homophobia from them and that's not okay. (laughs) So I just, I'm leaving it as it is. And then he said that I was following him, which is not true. That wasn't what was going on because he, the other (laughs) night when I went into his live, because we were talking, I've only followed him from another live because they were talking about gun rights. And I was trying to have a conversation with another person about gun rights. And then he sat there and he was flirting with me in the comments and it made me feel very uncomfortable. I was like, okay, we're not. This isn't a freaking uh, dating live. This is, we're talking about political issues. Like, it, it was a weird, weird situation. <laughs> JD. Uh, who, this was JD Morale? No, 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 no. This was, God, I don't even remember his name. Do you remember? Yeah, don't, don't say names. Well, I don't. I don't even. I just know. I, I don't remember. Like they changed their user, so I don't even know. Like they privatized their account now because. But yeah, that was the second guy that came in. Uh huh. Well, uh, no, but the first was, guy he he was up, and we were talking about books. Um, and Rose came up, and he got really upset. Oh, I know who you're talking. Are you talking about Dylan? I think so. 